A milestone in automotive engineering is marked by the completion of General Motors' Firebird II, the first gas turbine family car ever built and tested in the United States. Progress made possible by the pioneering of the original Firebird. Now gas turbine engines can be harnessed for cars and trucks, producing great power in small packages. And with the amazing new regenerator, exhaust heat is no longer a problem. Though the experimental car of tomorrow has a science fiction appearance, it is practical and usable in every design. Even the electronic safety highway is feasible for the future. Here, tomorrow's driver might just push a button and the car would literally drive itself. Its electronic receivers would pick up various impulses and roll it along in complete safety. Inside the car, a TV screen reveals pertinent travel information and gives highway and weather reports. Following these test runs, she heads for stardom in the 1956 Motorama. Matching the car with the road, the research men of General Motors seek complete comfort and safety for the motoring public. This laboratory on wheels not only runs on the safety autoway, but can be manually operated and driven, as it is here in the hills of Arizona. This may well be part of the American scene in 1976.